a recap of the AMA for Forex Shark and the Animal Farm. Let's get into it. Welcome to DeFi Crypto Talk, where you talk everything DeFi and the cryptocurrency space. So, I'm subscribers out there. Welcome back. If you're new to the channel, welcome. So, today we had the Forex Shark AMA, and he basically just talked about the uh, animal farm. So, I'm just going to go over a couple things that he uh, basically talked about uh, in the video. Um, just basically covering mostly the animal farm. So, nothing uh, obviously with Drip. He didn't really have anything to say. So, um, again, as I said in my previous video, um, right now Animal Farm sort of has a show. Um, and <clears throat> he even said towards the end of the AMA. Are, uh, right in the middle I should say that uh, you know now that they have these couple things coming out um, the core of the animal farm is now been complete basically so now he can start uh, that working on the other projects and promoting those other projects uh, you know for the animal farm so um, you know as far as drift concern um, you know I think it's gonna be gonna be a second because I think you're still trying to get the animal farm up and running but again I'm in both so I'm loving the fact that uh, you know TVL is rising on the animal farm and uh, you know we have an um, you know more and more innovations coming to the platform now uh, some of the big highlights so first things first I'm gonna pull this up so you guys could see so he said and this is all uh, mind you he mentioned this is all gonna be next Thursday so um, and they said they're gonna they're gonna set a, t a countdown so um, you know I don't I don't know if they're gonna put it on the side or how what it's gonna look like but he said that countdowns gonna be made so anyway first things first um, they said everything that says coming soon so I don't know if there's anything else um, on any of these other pages yeah like this um, so he said everything that says coming soon is going to be working so uh, that's one good thing so now we want to look at this coming soon stuff we can actually see the actual numbers populating um, another thing big thing he talked about was the governance so they did a test vote uh, within the admins and I guess everything works so they want to go live with it so uh, in other words how it's going to work is um, the site's going to update uh, when I say the site the animal farm and once it does update then uh, we're going to see you know the governance itself and you know going to be able to vote now the main token that will be used for the governance is going to be the pigs token so one pigs token will equal one vote so um, you know the, the devs are going to come out with a proposal for the community and depending on how much uh, you know depending on how much uh, pigs token that you have will determine how many votes you get for you know that that uh, that vote there so um, that I think that's good I think that's really really good um, I've seen it sort of go both ways when it comes to voting though because um, I've been in projects before where we've had the devs were putting out these votes um, and not saying I you know not accusing or saying anything about this about Forex or the project itself um, but I'm just saying previously what I've seen uh, some of the I would say some of the shadier projects shady projects that I was in um, so what they would do is put a vote out there and then some whale with uh, just a ridiculous amount of the tokens would come in and just you know just they would just be non-stop and they did it where and you know I didn't get to because my phone sort of died when I was listening to it but um, I didn't get to hear if they the devs actually get to vote as well um, on the you know on the proposal because in other projects I've seen it where the devs were able to vote and then they would just totally you know put it in their favor whether or not they wanted it to to, to fly or not so um, I don't know if that's gonna be the case in this one doesn't seem like it would be um, so um, I think that's good so we're gonna have definitely get to be able to uh, you know vote and uh, you know all come into somewhat of agreement as you know where the next steps should be um, for the animal farm um, another thing he mentioned which I thought was really cool too is uh, they have now now uh, without getting too much further into it because you mentioned something about the linear and odd compounding pools um, so bottom line up front um, on the auto compounding pool you will get 20% uh, more of the BNB so um, that push is going to be there um, which is really cool um, again I've, I've said this in previous videos I'm not really in the dog pound uh, like I'd want to be um, I haven't really like I've, I've you know and my goal was to use the garden to sort of get into it uh, and invest in it but you know the garden 
and drip you know they're sort of doing their thing right now so I don't really want to mess with those too much just to try to build it up really quick how much way the rates they, they they start building up a little bit more but um, yeah I mean definitely it's time to I would say it would be a good time to take advantage of that 20% more uh, BNB going into it I mean that, that I think that's that's incredible so um, all in all a lot of good uh, good things coming up uh, for the animal farm. I think all these updates are gonna look really, really good. And then, um, so I'm guessing that was the the you know the the big development announcement that he wanted to to mention. So um, hopefully after that we start getting some you know some of the news about a scratchy or something like that you know later on later on down the road and then eventually we start hearing some stuff about trip um you know um hopefully he can actually hire somebody else too like maybe have like two teams one for animal farm and one for drip and or excuse me yeah for drip and then he can you know just sort of moderate both of them but um overall some good stuff for the animal farm uh so really happy to hear that um so that's gonna be next thursday again he said he's going to uh put a timer up um, and then you know now and now is going to be the test because he mentioned too uh, previously that people need to see them put up a timer and actually launch when the timer runs out. So um, he did he did signal that. So hopefully that is the case. Um, comment down below uh, what do you guys think um, if that doesn't happen. You know hopefully hopefully it does. But if it doesn't, he gives you all of us at least a further enough warning. Um, so we know and not just sort of sort of sitting around waiting and you know um, Even with these updates what's going on for next Thursday I'll, I'll keep mentioning it, but as you guys know with Forex, you know in these launches don't expect it to launch like Exactly when the timer hits zero um, It normally takes a little bit longer than that in order for it to uh, you know start to kick in for the updates and all that stuff, but um, good to know, you know development and all that stuff and this is what you guys want to see This is what we want to see we want to see a dev who keeps improving building even during the down times because that's when you get to reap the benefits of you know stuff shooting up in the sky high uh once we hit the bear market so this is the time to start building stuff up and getting ready uh for the you know the eventual bull market so um i couldn't be more bullish so let me know what you guys think about the ama and uh comment down below if i missed anything in it um again my phone sort of died between the end i was trying to find a video somewhere here to uh, get a link to listen to it but um anyway that's the video for today hope you guys like it just a little short ama recap please comment like subscribe at the very bottom i appreciate your time and i will see you on the next one